personally. It's less addicting than many drugs, many opioids, but it is addicting. And I think just having this general use is a real problem. And we have this loophole in our law because as you've written and whatever about off label use, right? Uh, Matthew Definitely. Perry getting it as an off label use. And in your article, as you very nicely pointed out, the blood levels at attained, which are about, I don't know, 2000, uh, you know, nanograms per ml, I think, you know, are not attainable, uh, you know, days after uh, having uh, uh, ketamine given intravenously. So you have to be taking a bunch of it. And as it came out and uh, reported in the press, because there was, a, I think, uh, a, um, a conviction uh, of one of his uh, staff that uh, they were administering uh, uh, intramuscular injections of ketamine you know, uh, beyond what he was getting from his uh, psychiatrist in terms of an IV infusions periodically. I think, I think there has to be some boundaries on the use of this. And 